you know, the points being what they are, and we, we saw them 19 points in 19 games for you. That's pretty impressive. But, um, you know, 23 minutes a game, that's what you were averaging. I mean, you weren't really dipping your toe in the water. It was playing at a very high level in minutes that you probably haven't seen since your days in Tri-City. How did it feel, I guess, to get that kind of workload in while you're sort of transitioning back into just getting games again? Well, I think that's uh, that's the type of game I want to play eventually in, in the NHL too. But I think that's that's who I've been, um, you know, most of my career. And when I was uh, when I was younger, I, I used to do that. And I think I feel like I'm one of those players who, you know, when I play more, I play better, pretty much. So, um, you know, getting all those minutes, I think it only kind of helped. Um, I think it was my second game. I played 25 minutes. It was a back to back too, and I'm like, well, that didn't even feel like 25 minutes. So I guess that's a that's a good thing, right? So um, obviously, there's a lot of things. I you know I've, I've been able to work on my you know physical side and off ice stuff a lot, and, and being in good shape and stuff. So that helps. But um, yeah, I think I think it's just at the end of the day, I haven't done it in a while, but I'm. Um, you know, I'm used to it and, and in stock and I get to see that that kind of role in a l- little bit when I was still playing. So it's not completely new and or anything like that. So I guess uh, that probably helps. And um, yeah, I think that's I'm one of those guys who, you know, enjoy playing and enjoy playing as much as they can. And I would play whole game if that'd be possible. So that just <laughs> helps uh, helps to play better. 60 minutes time on ice. (laughs) That'd be great. That'd be awesome.